Hey guys, I'm um, just going to come on here and show you pretty quickly how to complete a crustless quiche. Okay? And if you're not a big egg lover, it's okay because it's you really don't taste the eggs. So what you're just going to need is, is six eggs. I'm just going to show you how I do it. Easy as possible. Okay, got my six eggs. I just got some sausage. I'm going to cook it in the on the stove. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and add some pepper. Some salt. Put a little lemon pepper in here. Just some seasonings. Some parsley flakes. This is all stuff that I add. You don't have to add it. It's just what I do. Okay. And then I'm going to mix it up with my whisk. Make sure the eggs get beat just a little bit. Just so that they're mixed through. Okay. And then you just need two-thirds cup of heavy whipping cream. This is the fourth, but it'll do. And I just use some regular heavy whipping cream. No! Put, put two-thirds of that in there. Okay, mix it some more. And then I just put some shredded cheese in here. Whatever kind you want to use. This is just some sharp cheddar. Some people don't use, they shred their own. Um, I just use this. Okay, and then I'm just going to mix that up. And then all I do then next is I have my pan. And I will just spray it with, I use avocado oil spray. You can use whatever you want to, whatever you desire. I spray that on there. And then what I'll do is I'll cook the sausage on the stove till it's brown. I'll drain it. And then I'll put it in the bottom and then just pour that mixture on top. Cook it in the oven at 350 for uh, about 20 minutes and you've got quiche and you can put it in a refrigerator split it up in the individual freeze it whatever you want to do and you've got quiche for breakfast or lunch or dinner all right guys i just want to come on and show you how i do this quick recipe you can use it for breakfasts in the morning without having to really make a whole lot all right we'll see you later